is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is uh, a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. There's the whistle. It's a great gallop down the right-hand side. Can he deliver? He's gone for it! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. Pamplona to retain the ball, but are seemingly in no rush to break forward. And it's played forward. And that is as far as they're going to go. Tries to get it forward quickly. He's had a go! Oh, that's a fine save! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes work ultra sharp. Fakir, who's short. Oh, that's nice. Time to deliver. Up to meet it! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Well, as Tesco beat it, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. There's a lot of movement up front. Yeah, I have noticed that those uh, front players are working very hard, dropping deeper. Yeah, and I just think it keeps the opposition off guard with, with so much switching of position. Keeping shape is, is much harder. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Balls out on the left now. Gorgeous control there. So who's he picking out? Oh, nice touch. Chance to cross here. And that's been well dealt with. William Carvalho. William Carvalho goes looking. He brings the first half to a close. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. It's the first half compared with your expectation. I think it's been a very impressive defensive effort. They've never been broken down and contained the opposition attack extremely well. After 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change perhaps after half time. So we're already into the second period. Well, that first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we'd hoped. Lots of effort, but a, a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone can step up and produce something a little more magical. It's a fine run, and he's happy to keep going. It's a decent-looking cross. Danger averted for now. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? Now it's Fekir. It's Carvalho. Carvalho goes for goal. Oh, it's die-hard defence and the willingness to put his body on the line. Very impressive. William Carvalho back into the middle. 
Fakir, Carvalho. Could try cutting inside here. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. As scoreless games go, I'd be happy to see this one carry on a bit longer because it's had great honesty and... And the finish! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Oh, I'm not sure what he had in mind, and I don't think he knew either. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Look, their supporters must be going barmy about this because there's no sense of purpose in what we're seeing. Forward it goes. And it's Adrian, William Carvalho. So that's it. It is all over. And stalemate. One, if not for fans, then perhaps for coaches. Satisfied by organisation and solidity. A little cutting edge at either end. And it finishes nil-nil. Your final thoughts, Jim? Well, neither side could get over the line here. Perhaps one team might be happier, but at the final reckoning, it's honours even and no complaints. Well, that's it for tonight's match. So it just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin alongside me and to wish you all a very good evening.